Monty Saldo is actually a very strong guy for the size that he was. Is How big was he? Like 135 to 147, I think, at his heaviest. Huh. But Tiny. That's, yeah. That's about what my leg weighs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Well, he was famous for tearing three decks of cards at one time. Three oh, decks. Wow. Three decks. You have to be a showman as a strongman. This guy really played it up and was just an amazing performer. And we all have to be performers in our own way. Now, it's not to take each card and tear it. It's tear the deck all at once. All right. I figured we'd start out and see if the guys could actually tear one deck of cards. The cards are a lot bigger and a lot better made now. And there's a few different decks. I would imagine the yeah. cards are different. Your cards are smaller. You have a small deck? No, they are a little bit smaller. Yeah, they are, actually. Yeah. Okay, a smaller might be harder, though. Okay. If you bend the cards, it's gonna be way harder to tear. Ripping a deck of cards was a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. When I started to tear at it, nothing happened. It took a minute before it even started tearing. I must admit, it's tough on your hands, isn't it? It very. Yeah. yeah, I don't think that's happening for me, man. It's cutting into my fingers. Look, I'm a strong man and I have really incredible grip strength, but I don't do ripping cards. I actually like to lift real weight. You're just gonna quit. I'm, I'm, I wouldn't call it Four quitting. times world's strongest man. <laughs> I'm done. I can't even hold ah. on to it because it's all coming apart. There we go. Yeah, there it goes. There it goes. There it is. There. I think mine was the best one. Mine was actually in Haast. I'm impressed that a guy who weighed 144 pounds it's insane. could tear through three. It's hard. I feel like a man that small ripping three decks of cards would be impossible. But there's so many accounts of it, it's it's hard to argue against that. Why don't you show us how you to do it? You show us how it's done. Oh, lovely. Get it. On your mark, set, go. I will give everything I have on everything that I do because I want to win against these guys. Las Vegas, represent. 15 seconds. Come on, Nick. I'm trying. It's your trick. You rip a deck of cards by squeezing the cards in this hand and then taking this hand and pinching it in here and putting a lot of pressure and twisting it till the deck st actually starts to wear and tear. They all go in. <clears throat> Come on, finish it, Nick. Run through. You got it. It actually takes a lot of force to do it, and it actually kind of strain my elbow a little bit. Finish it up. <laughs> nice. There you go. Well done, Nick. Thanks, guys. That was freaking hard. Yeah. <laughs> that was hard. <laughs> <It's the work. laughs> Until you get used to doing it, it's, it's kind of a painful thing to do. Right, well, we were tearing cards to find a winner. Well done, Nick. Thanks, guys. I'm 50 years old, and I'm going against these guys in their early 30s, so it's kind of fun to be able to beat them on things, and I think it really kind of gets to them and bothers them. It's like getting beat by your dad. We did find out a loser. Yeah, with those tiny, yeah. weak cards that you three had. Tiny, weak cards tiny, or weak, tiny, weak hands. Tiny, weak hands. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. okay. Oh, I'll take it. I'll take it. An L's an L, baby. Hey. It is what it is. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, what we got next? Let's go listen. I'm up for that. You want me to hold your little hands? Okay, <laughs> all right. <laughs>